and my name is Amanda Cox, and I'd like to welcome you to the Williams Bryce House, a part of the Sumter County Museum. Some museums go way back to prehistoric times, and they might display the skeleton of a dinosaur. Some museums focus on a place, like this museum that focuses on Sumter. Our museum saves and displays things from the past so that we can learn about what life was like for those who came before us. In every museum, you will see labels that go with the objects you see. These labels tell you about what you're looking at. Still in the dining room, as we turn and look at the wall behind me, we see portraits of four women. Art was a very important part of life to many during this time period, and it was also a form of entertainment for them. These are not actually paintings, they are drawings done in chalk pastel. Each woman represents a different season of the year. One for spring, one for summer, one for fall, and one for winter. Whenever we look closely at these, I want you to look at the detail and see if you can figure out which one represents each season.
Hi, my name is Diana Roof. I'm Temple Sinai Jewish History Center Site Manager, and I'm going to introduce to you what you will see if you come in here to enjoy the exhibits. You will learn about Judaism and Jewish holidays, and you will learn about Jewish customs. We have a section that tells how Jewish people came to South Carolina, a special section for Sumter Jewish um, businesses and just different people that you might know. You'll be able to walk through a Holocaust section, and as you come around the back, you'll be able to learn about our Holocaust survivor, Mr. Abe Stern, which I'm sure many of you have visited Jack's Shoes at one time or another. As you come around the back, you will actually be able to come into our sanctuary where I'm standing right now. Um, you'll be able to learn about the history of the temple itself, the history of the windows, and the different things that are here in the sanctuary. Um, we have a special hall called the Ackerman Hall where we have traveling exhibits. And they, and they will, right now um, we have Curious George and you'll be able to learn about how Curious George was created and the journey of the Rays who wrote his story.